983, go ahead. Traffic stop. It's going to be on route 54 eastbound, just east of Barclay Road, Sangamon County. Route 54 eastbound, just east of Barclay Road, Sangamon County. Black Mazda SUV, Black Mazda SUV. I'll be out of the car. You got my hat. Just, yeah, just wait here, man, okay? 983, 10 4. There, 2008 Mazda Carry L064. You got a passenger? I'm checking that now. Roll this down, please. How are you? Hey. You can roll this one down now if you want. I don't see one. Hey, you got a passenger in here with you? Huh? Huh? Okay. Do you have your license insurance on you? Okay, I'm going to come around there, okay? Okay, that's fine. All right. That's good. I just got to find my purse real quick. Huh? I got to find my purse real quick. That's all. Okay. That's all I'm looking for. I'm sorry. No, you're good, you're good, you're good. You're good. I'm just, I'm not. Can you roll the side of one down for me real quick, please? Yeah. Just standard stuff, thank you. Uh, all the way, if you could. Oh, I'm sorry. Where are you coming from? I just can't hear, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm actually going, I'm coming from Kentucky. Okay. Daniels, I'm going back. Okay. Right here, right here, right here. Uh, that's fine. Is there anyone in the back or anything? No. Okay. Did you have anyone here at one point? Earlier today, yeah. Oh, yeah. Who was that? It was my friend. I'm going to say I had my sister with me. Hey, have you had anything to drink today? Um, no. I said no. Huh? I said no, but I definitely spilled my liquor a Cause I, well, that's why I'm asking. Over, oh, it? over there, I could smell it big time. I, I mean, yeah. I did spill it on the floor, but it's actually fully wet over there. If you want to. Look. Okay. Do you have your license or anything on you? That's fine. Any other open alcohol or anything in here? No, there's not. There's not. There's not. Okay. Can you step out for me real quick, just so. Just so I can talk to you to make sure it definitely yeah, is just to spill it on the floorboard, okay? Yeah, fine. Okay. The, oh, you've actually got yeah, it. Right? It's literally every. Can I see that? Yeah. You can take that. Let's say you can do breath and everything. I have well, this is also this is alcohol on here. It was at one point. I'm gonna say it's done. Okay. Uh, why don't you over here? I can't hear you. Okay. okay. I'm following you. I'm sorry. Okay. I know I was speeding. We went. Why don't you over here? My aunt's been sick. She actually lives in she McDaniels. Was? She's mixed up. She lives in McDaniels. Okay. And it's my birthday. It was actually just on the 20th. Look, have you had a little look, bit? No. Literally. Okay. I have not been drinking today. My 21st just anything. passed. Okay. 21st Unfortunately, just passed. you can't have open alcohol in Illinois. That. Okay. I'm sorry. Give me my ticket. You're good. Do you have I your insurance need. on you? I do have it. I have to pull it up on my phone. Hey, do you mind? Uh, can you show me back in the hatch? Let's make sure you don't have more alcohol, open alcohol huh? in there. Is that okay? Can you just open this hat for me and stuff? I just want to make sure you have no open alcohol in there, okay? He's taking off. Get your hands up. Get your hands up. Hands up. Stop. 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 Get him. Please get him. Sprinkle. Stop. Stop. Get him. Please get him. Sprinkle. 93 something just took off. You try to drag one of the marshals with him. Do I have permission to pursue? 93 10 for your location. Hold that. Rob 54, he's going on a pretty school road now. Hold that. 93 10 for He is dragging a marshal. Request additional units now. Eighty-three, 
I will be pursuing. He just dumped the marshal. Marshal's up around with me, okay? Eastbound on Route 54, passing Spalding now, Main Street. Nine, ninety-three in pursuit, Illinois, fifty-four eastbound, passing Spalding. Illinois, fifty-four eastbound, passing Spalding. Black, two thousand eight miles of carry-all, black, two thousand eight miles of carry-all. Any units in the area advised. Gotta be smart about this, though. Crossing River Bridge. Speed's approximately 115 miles per hour. If we're crossing what bridge? Sangman River, we're going to be approaching Brickford pretty soon. Are you eastbound? Eastbound, correct. underneath a bunch of clothing and took off the driver's seat. Sprinkle 9-3, Route 54, getting ready to pass Gap on the drive. I believe it was a Carhartt, uh, tan Carhartt jacket. Male 10-4. We're on Sangman now. He's crossing over I-55. He's heading into Springfield. He just 1050. He's heading now westbound down Sangman Avenue, bounce off the guardrail. He's heading the wrong way into traffic. Just confirming, 83, you're no longer pursuing. Sangman County's with me now. If 91 wants me to terminate, I'll terminate. I've still got eyes on. distance though to so keep eyes on but I am no longer pursuing. Lights and siren are off. Camera will be off. And go ahead and send me a field report for fleeing or looting. Good for it.
Mayday, turn with you. If so, just stay in the car. 10 4. Hey, sir. I got an intern with me. I've been told to stay by the car. I've got an intern with me. I've been told to stay by the car. So, All right, that'll work. okay, thank you. Springfield 93. I'm outside the car, but I am staying with the car uh, with the intern for 35 instructions. for subject 1050 here in the center median uh, the Clear Lake Avenue westbound just west of the Dirksen intersection Clear Lake westbound just west of Dirksen One from 983. Uh, he was up moving around when I passed him in pursuit of this vehicle. Uh, but yeah, still Chuck, definitely. He had another federal agent with him, correct? 10 4. There were two, from what I could see, hanging on to the vehicle. Uh, the first one was shooken off early on, then there was one that he probably uh, was attached to that vehicle for a good tenth of a mile, quarter of a mile before he got dumped off. If you just want to drop that on the floorboard, man, because I don't know what's on that with you know with her that orange bottle. Here, I'll give you some uh, some foaming stuff because I don't know what the hell's on that. So, no, but it's fine. The last location we had for the session was Burger Park, clearly in Durham. Hi, it's Alcohol. I have copies of the crime report the rest of your Springfield 93, uh, just to double check to you, there was a female driver, I believe it's going to be the registered owner, I have her 1027, I'll give that to you here as soon as I can, anybody know anything about what's going on with her? At 10-4, she was with the marshals when I left, I'm just inquiring as to what's going on with her. Whenever we hear anything, no big deal right now. The license there. Here's your phone. Nine thirty five information. Go ahead. Can you arrive at that location where you check to see where the female driver was? Yeah, more. What was across with that Berkeley? Ten four Route fifty four, just east of Barclay. Ten four, ten sixty. 
strength when I throw the 1027 for that female driver when you're ready. Hey, three, go ahead. 1027, last name is Rhodes, R-H-O-D-E-S, first name is Nancy, N-A-N-C-I, middle name of Ann, A-double-N, Rhodes, Nancy, Ann, female... Three ten four roads valid. Duplicate. Temporary license issue two thirteen of eighteen to zero five fourteen of eighteen. Yeah, she lied to me when she said there was no one else in there, so that's obstruction right there. I should hook her for it. One thing, uh, when you said that. I saw him hopping in the road, but the reason I did not reach in after him is because of that, because I didn't want to get dragged like that. Right. And obviously he wasn't uh, sticking my gun in his face, didn't do anything. Right. Let me go out and talk to those guys. Cool. Go ahead, 86. Let her transport up to me now. Fancy. You good, dude? Yeah, I'm good. They kept telling us eastbound from Prairie School, just passing Spalding. What? No, I was I was literally up being like every cross street that I went by. So. I heard you out there. If I'd have known you had something, so I might have. Well, that's what I was telling the intern. I said I saw him. Hop, I saw. It was kind of neat to me what I did. Is she had open alcohol. I said, Hey, do you mind opening the hatch for me so I can see if you have any more open alcohol in here? So I see all the this vehicle. Like he jumps in the driver's seat. I know he's gonna take off. So I stick my gun in his face. Say, Hey, don't even think about it. He just he just freaking takes off. And like I told him, so that's the reason I didn't reach the vehicle because I didn't want to get dragged a mile. U.S. Marshal was, yeah. Okay. Where He's way back there, right? Uh -huh. I mean, he fell off. He, went, he fell off on 54. We were probably just about, I'd say, about a quarter mile west of Lion Street there. So, basically just, huh? This county, I guess, has got him. No, no, no. The DEA got him. Huh? He's got the DEA guy. Yeah. I can, yeah. I'll take him. A lot of currency on Does he? They, want, they said he won on a warrant, so I get to run him. They're checking on him right now. As far as you know, the guy that got dragged quite a distance and got and fell off, he rolled a little bit, but then he got up and started walking away when I passed him. So that's the last I saw him. I was trying to keep eyes on this dude. They're all accounted yeah, for. Yeah, they're all accounted I don't know who picked him okay. up. <laughs> um, the other VA guys, they, they had their own car out there. They, they pulled in behind me. Okay, so what happened is that I go up there, there's no one there, but there's a bunch of clothes in the back seat. So I'm thinking, well, you know. So then she's got open alcohol, and she admitted, and she shows me the bottle. I said, hey, can you open that hatch for me real quick? I want to see if you got any more open alcohol in here. And then, boom, he jumped in the driver's seat and took off. Gotcha. Okay. All right. And she lied to me and said there was no one in there, so I, I'm halfway tempted to pop her for obstruction. Well, absolutely. So. <laughs> Where's he at? Let's, let's secure that first. Yeah, I'll get that in my car. And then we'll get him and secure him and search him for your company. Yep. Hey, Trooper Price, let's hold off and see what the marshals will do. They just arrived. I want to see if, they, if they're going to take us here, what they're wanting us to do. Because this was originally their show, so. You made the stop. Yeah. In case these guys can get out here. Yeah, sounds good. Where's he at? You have a cage, correct? I do. Okay. Nothing in the cage? Nope. Okay. My bag's in the back. I'm going to have to, you know. Why don't you do that first? Yeah, yeah I have no place to put that bag, though. Yeah. That's the problem. I'll take the intern if you want. Okay. Or I can transport him. Do you have more room? Because I got a, I have an, I have an open cage. I don't have a little half cage. Fine. I'll put my cuffs on him. That'd be great. I'll take him to jail if you fill out the PC sheet. Yep, sounds good.
thing and then bailed. He hit that sign where the SUV's at. Bailed, took off that way. That's why I continue. When you said terminate the first time. Well, I didn't say terminate. I was waiting for everything. Somebody said about it. So I killed my lights, and then I saw he was getting ready to 1050. got him back on, saw him bailing. I had him was off. He dragging? Was he dragging them off? He dragged two of them. Okay. Yeah, all right. One, yeah, they're good. They said they're all present. I counted four, so. And they're calling out 54 and something, and I turned on the scene and almost got hit head on for wrong way. So I That's what he did. He bounced off the guardrail uh, westbound on the scene and just east, uh, west of 54. Did they not have her? No, they don't have her. Uh, then she, then she, then she's still walking along 54, yeah. You can bring her here, yeah, that'd be great. No. Almost got over with got over with he bounced off the guard, and then he started heading west, and then, you know, came through all do this stuff. Okay. I was I was instructed to terminate uh, Dirksen just south of uh, Sangamon. So I basically just kept on following distance. That's about it. I'm waiting to see what the marshal will do, because they, they, they were wanting their uh, him specifically, so I want to see what they want to do first before I do any charges or anything. Because they might have their own now that he drug a couple of them. So... The one guy probably got dragged a good quarter of a mile, at least. He's good. He, yeah, he was holding up on the car. I just had his gun out, and the guy wouldn't stop. So. Huh. I think what we're going to do, uh, once we find out, secure four hours. That's just that it's secure indefinitely, but it's okay. So when you uh, got terminated... At what point, when you came into town? Once, uh, once we came into town, the captain said, hey, what speed you going? I said, well, we're heading south on Dirksen. We're doing about 68 miles, you know, 68 mile an hour. He said, yep, terminate. Okay. And that was at Dirksen, uh, just south of Sangamon. Okay. And then, uh... And then, and then you, I just saw you guys' lights. I had to, I was way back, so I mean, you guys were way up there. And then when I rolled up here, I saw you had 1050 right here, and you guys were chasing him. Okay. So more than likely, what I'm going to need is if, uh, if this ends up, since this definitely is a multi-agency thing, if they're in that making me primer in this, I'd like at least from each agency at least one supplemental report from yeah. each agency. Yeah. Like, yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. You'll get two from us. You'll get one from him and one from Steve. Let me find out what the marshal because I have this is they were wanting us to pull them over specifically for this dude. You know what the what charges are on him? Is it the charges? Uh, they just said he was he's warned for heroin possession. What they told me. I don't have any really specifics about that. I have yet to run him. He's not wanting to talk to me at all. That doesn't surprise me. Yes, you think? Um, you want to get your intern out so you can see what's up? Yeah. Hey. Hey Z. Yeah, you come out, man. What a mess. I know. All because this guy decides to be a freaking... Hey, I gotta go talk to... Uh, I'm gonna call it SPD real quick. Yeah. Hey, uh, guys, um, if I end up being primary in this thing, what the marshals want to do, uh, whoever's doing the report for your department, can I get that as a supplemental to mine if I end up being primary? I just got here. No, oh, never mind. No worries. <laughs> I'm out. Yeah, he's not going if not, no big deal. I, 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 I write. You all right? Was that you? He almost hit head on right there. Yeah. Yeah. I was told to terminate once I got to Dirksen, just south of Sangman, because I said, well, we're doing like 70 down Dirksen. So thank you all for your help. I appreciate it. But it's a freaking mess. What happened is I, I pulled the gal over for going 70 down Route 54. Hey, anybody else in here with you? Nope. So, uh. I smell alcohol, and I go around there, I'm thinking, okay, it might be a possible DUI or whatever, so no DUI on her part, but she had open alcohol. I was like, hey, uh, can you open the hatch, and there was a bunch of clothes just all spilled out over the back seat, and I go, hey, can you open the hatch real quick so I can see if you got any more open alcohol in here? Boom, he jumped in the driver's seat and took off, so I stuck my gun right in his face, and he goes like that, and he just, he's like, screw you, and he just took off. He dragged one marshal probably a good quarter of a mile or so. I want to wait to see what they're doing because I'm sure they're going to have their own charges for dragging a federal agent like that. Have you status on him yet? Have you heard anything from him yet? Oh, he's refusing to talk to anybody. Yeah, yeah they're all present in the counter for good to go. Yeah, no one's seriously heard or anything, so. Thank you, guys.
he's not going to talk to you or anything. Yeah, he's wanting to go to the hospital. So I'm sure he is wanting to go to the hospital. Who is somebody else that come obviously? I can go with him if you want to do that. Sounds like you have some paperwork. Yeah, I'm going to have to go straight to the post and get this paperwork done before shit and shit. Apparently, she's still out on Route 54. I thought the marshals had her. There was nothing like they told me. I, they were they were yelling at me to hey, go take off after him. That's not good. Uh, she may have taken off herself. So obviously, don't tell him any information. Then I'm not gonna say a word to him. So. Hey, you got your guys all right, man? Uh, I got an ambulance coming to check them out. Uh, which one of you guys, were you the one that got dragged that whole way, or which one was that? Robinson, he's over there. Is he okay? I mean, his elbow's pretty banged up, but I think if her, the other one's elbow's banged up. Do you want to talk to him? What do you guys, uh, I, I believe my department will want to talk to him, yes. What do you, how do you want me to handle it? Do you want me to be like, climber like any other, like, stop, and he just took off, or what? I, I, I would say so. I mean, you, you can let him know that, that we have advised you that he was possibly coming back and that we were there behind it. And I mean, I'll write a report to my agency, and I, I'll probably attach that as a supplemental or something to my uh, my report that I'm yeah, doing. I, mean, I don't know what charges you have. Did you see him drive at the guardrail? Is that I saw everything. Camera? Yeah, it's all over. Yeah, so I've got... Yeah, all over your camera, too. Right? Yeah, I got, I got all kinds of speeding charges. I got all kinds of... Rec I got reckless driving. I've got all kinds of stuff. Yeah, I don't know bad. whether that's going to be... Whether it's going to be... Uh, Fucking attempted murder or I'm not sure to see what that guy, you want your guy had his gun in his face and he wasn't stopping. So, no, he's right in here. Yeah, do you want to go ahead and put him in your car? Yep. He is acting like he's in Get out. So he has to go to Oh, you can't move now? Yeah. Right. You can go to the hospital right now. You could drag them, though, couldn't oh, you, dude? That's do what? Uh, I'll, let, I'll let you guys determine that. If you guys want to figure that out. Here, let's just go and talk to this over. So, here's what we got, guys. Uh, Catlin makes a stop. He has charges on him. Do you want them to take him and interview him? Is that what we're going to do? Let's we're, stand by. I think the marshals. Uh, nine one. Um, respect. We'll just stand by for a sec, sir. I'm just trying to sort some stuff out with the marshals. Careful, whatever you can clear there. Go help thirty-five. I'm going to He's wanting me to clear here and go help thirty-five look for the female. So, um, if this is okay with you, yeah, he will take some. Does all the interviews, everything takes him to on the end, right? That's fine with me. You have no issues with that? No, if I just, also, glad we got the dude. Also, guys, if I can do anything, that's fine. Um, so right now, the paperwork, I'm, I'm going to have a fleeting eluding report, yeah. and then what, is it's that about it at this point? What do you think, do you think, is that about it at this point, just fleeing and eluding? They're all going to have to have to get a phone number for him, because he's going to have a different phone number. He's going to have to get a phone number for him. He's got the, the marshal charge him with this, that, and the other. Going to be some vehicle problem. He's going to be he's going to be talking. He got lots of money on him, obviously. But he's going to have other charges. Who wants the evidence? Is in the trunk. Talk to him about it and get his telephone number. Okay. I'm going to go. I'm going to go. Thank you. Are you are you Quentin? I'm sorry. I'm Anthony. Anthony, hey, uh, can I get your number? Um, I've got evidence. Do you want to take a look at the evidence that he made with a, uh, I guess he tried to talk to so they had him. He had like all kinds of cash and stuff on him. I got it secured in my trunk right now if you want to see it. Yeah, I mean, uh, sure. Uh, basically, I think what's going to happen is, uh, and ma'am, this is what I was told, sorry, I guess you guys are transporting him, doing the arrest and all that stuff. I'm literally just doing a report for like if a dude took off on me. Okay. And then... Your phone number, all I need that for is you're going to call me, if you would respectfully call me and let me know what charges you have, and that will all be included in my report that I have to do. Okay. And the stuff that you have in your trunk, what are you, what are you doing with that? Are you? I guess I'd hand it, would, would it be okay if I hand it off to you, ma'am? You, I don't care who takes credit for this, I'm just glad the dude's off the road and everything. So. Well, everything he operated through in relation to their case. So. Do you want the evidence then, sir? I mean, we'll, we'll take Okay. Um, Okay. Over. It's a lot of cash and some stuff in there too. So. Okay. Would uh. I mean, if it's gonna be me writing the report, number one, it's out in the county. It's not really in the city. 
So can I write an FCC report to say that? Um, well, we may have to have the county do an original. And then you write an addendum to? Assist another agency. You've got the warrant report. Because right now all I have is a traffic stop on the female, and then basically at this point it's like fleeing and eluding. I observed this male subject do this, and he took off at such, you know, I observed all this at such and such a time, you know, because I, uh, I was heading south on Dirks and just uh, south of Stangman, and that's when my captain asked me, he goes, hey, what speed you do? And I said, hey, about 60, and he said, you're, he goes, no, you're done, terminate, so. Hey, can I get your region? Like, how hard is it to transfer that? How, do you know how they do that anymore? Yeah. Okay. Sir, yeah. you have his, you have his, you have his telephone number. I'm getting it's that right email now. Email address. Can you, can you write that down for me real quick? Are you taking the cash? Are you guys taking all property? Yeah, I'll get a property receipt. Okay. And then I'll need to sign too because it's exchanging from my hand to his and all that. So like, we got a good chance okay. of us going. Why don't I go? Well, you nine nine one, one nine one told me to go. So. Well, you're not going anywhere until that property is exchanged. Yeah. He said just that on 54 to help 35 looks at the female. I don't. Did you guys happen to see which way the female went after all I this started? I sent over there to try to pick her up. Okay, because she's probably walking out in the country somewhere. She's probably picked up already by somebody. <laughs> that one, maybe you can give him your information, your mm -hmm. telephone, and your field report number. Yeah, i got to go check to see if Tracy even sent that to me yet. So how does that work? Like with Pertus now, do, you, do I do a sign that sheet before he gets out of here? I mean, if he's oh, going to no. release it to me, yeah, let me grab one real quick. And let's do whatever I have to do. Yeah, that's right. And I'll go ahead and give you my information. <laughs> I was talking to a lieutenant here, and basically. Did you, did, did you make the stop for them? I did. Okay. What we may do is we just may write our assist agency report off of your original. Okay. And that way we don't have to count. You know what I mean? Okay. I'm trying to think. So this report, my mind's basically going to be a fleeing and a looting report at this point. Yeah, just basically. We can add charges off of our. Okay, I just want to make sure, like, I don't want to overstep step on anyone's toes or anything here. So. An original report on something that didn't happen in our jurisdiction. I know, it's a mess, it's a mess, and it's like, it makes sense. So, we can cover all kinds of stuff. I'm sorry, ma'am, excuse me. Go ahead. Did you by chance have a loading description on that female? Oh, geez, what was she wearing? I have standby. He's got a fight right here, it's not real bad, but he'll break the skin. He's got some bruising, so I don't know if he's going to be checked out. He's going to be checked out, I'll talk to him as I don't, if I, it was, I can't remember if it was blue jeans or leggings. A strength on night three, not at this time. Uh, but it was a female and like auburn type colored hair. Uh, okay, just to give you guys a heads up what's going on, when we thought we were going to transport, I talked to him, I said, are you injured anyway? He said, legs injured, you might have Okay. Since you guys are now transporting them after this, it's going to just be, it's just going to be your officer. Okay. 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 Do you have the cash you have to give them? I, everything's in my trunk. I just waiting for the handoff, so. Um, you have all their information. The I got his. The thing that we need to figure out is how we can get a copy of your guys' first Here, go ahead, man. Can you read that? That's uh, my first and last name. There's an underscore there. It's not a dash. So. Okay. Yes, yes, sir. Right? Can you tell me all that uh, video to him? I can't. I'm pretty sure. I'm trying. I have no idea how to do that. I'll be honest with you. It's just all this new USB stuff. I have no clue. Everything's wireless at this point. So once it's downloaded, you can make a CD and you can give it to whoever, or you can email it to him. Because that may go with the charges that they're going to okay. have. Yeah. Understood. Right. Hopefully that's easy. Who would I talk to about that? Okay. Uh, Tim? Uh, Woods. Or, uh, Woods? Okay. I'll talk to our court officer and find out how I get that downloaded to you. And I can probably get it maybe in a PDF version, I'm not sure, or a media file.
If I knew how to do it, I would. But like I said, we switched all that just wireless crap now, so I don't know how to. I'll pray. Getting it out over here. Okay. Sir, if you want to come back here. Yeah. Are you okay? I mean, oh, yeah, I'm fine. Okay. I just remember, I couldn't remember if she was wearing black leggings like or torn blue jeans. I, uh, I can't Where was he hiding in the car? He was underneath all the clothes in the back seat okay. or in the hatch because what I did is when I, I she had open alcohol on her. Mm -hmm. So when I said, hey, can you open the hatch to see, I want to see if you got more open alcohol, that's when he started, he jumped over the seat. And, uh, 9-1 from 983. I'm just handing off some evidence to the marshals here, and then I'll be headed out that way.